Hello everyone, how you're doing? It's Michelle here. I'm just knitting a little bit of my <coughs> my hat. I explained last week I had a like a pom 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 yarn, I think it's called. It's like it's in a cake like that. Double knit. Um and I had it in a gift uh, from our room leader for Christmas and it's that colour and it's the hat. Not done much on it at all. I was on late so last week so you re when I'm on late, I really struggle to get anything done whatsoever. Really struggle. I've not been feeling great at all. I've been really, really heavy cold again. Sick of it. I don't want to start eating healthily, honestly. I eat really healthily and then I still end up with colds. But I suppose that's the perks of working with children, isn't it? So it looks like I've got lipstick on. I haven't. My lips are dead sore and I've come out in a whacking whacking cold sore um but yeah oh, i don't know so yeah i'm doing a little bit of this these are those needles i had off amazon it's the ones what are acrylic um these are four mils and this four they're good for arthritis and things like that they are so light so there's no heaviness whatsoever to them um so yeah they seem to be knitting okay for me i you know yeah, I've only done this much, but this seemed to be, and as you can see, the rib is neat enough. Um, yeah, the rib's neat enough in it, so, so yeah, that's that. <coughs> Been to the hairdressers this morning and nipped out, got a few bits, three bits and bobs that I needed. Oh, she's it's look she's your hair looks really light if you put a different colour on it. I said you're not the first, but no. So I'll tell you why, it's because of that. <laughs> That's why it looks light. They're grey. But oh well. Perks are getting older, that one. Oh, lots of perks today. This is the mood blanket. As you can see, this is January. This is the length of January is not even over yet. And that's only up till Thursday. No, Wednesday. I've still got Thursday, Friday to put in. Yeah, that was Wednesday. Sarah left at work, so it was sad. Jack weren't very well as well. Um, but now I've got Thursday, Friday and today to catch up on. I mean, that's the one row repeat pattern. I lo I'm loving it, I'm loving it, I'm loving it. Um, I am carrying the wool up the side. Make it a bit easier. Uh, but yeah, I wish that I'd done two rows now. So note to self or note to anybody out there, um, if you're using double knit and you're doing a blanket for a whole year, I think two rows would be sufficient. But no, I've done four rows for each. Now these are the day. So that's a day, that's two days. That's a day, that's a day. A day, a day, yeah, two days. So... Not many days in a row where I'm uh, happy, is there? <laughs> the red is like angry, frustrated. And they're work days. <laughs> but yeah, so that's that. It'll be super king size, honestly, by the time it's finished in December. So they're, they're knitted on my zings, the metal ones, the big ones. Um, and then I'm going to put some stuff up on it. So I've been trying to take photographs this morning because I know, and I should take the dog a walk. Um, I'm going to do she's asleep in a minute if you can hear any snoring. I'm going to get her up. But it's because it's so icy. It's so icy on the on her feet and that. Like, I don't want to like take her out. But I am going to do. Um, but yeah, my mum, my mum's made some. This is like a very, very... You can't really... You don't really show up. It's a very, very pale lilac. With like um, a silver sparkle running through it. It's beautiful. Bobbles. Not to three. Um, this is a very pale blue. That pattern in it. Um, that one. She weren't keen on this wool. She said it were weren't great. It was one off Amazon. It was a baby one off Amazon, but she said she weren't keen on that at all. She said it made the stitches because uh, I can see what she means. But yeah, I don't know. And this one was the same one, if she weren't keen on this. This was the same t wool, but right, I think it looks beautiful. I think it's lovely. I don't think there's anything wrong with it, but I suppose when you're knitting with it, it is red. 
it's not like um that type of red what's in my new mood bank it's like a warmer red so beautiful and the bobbles i love bobbles so that's another one and then the last one is a purple purple sparkle um, same on the back and that's they're all not to three those i've just shown you i'm also going to put this up this is a 20 inch um, this is what the lovely Sandra knitted and sent me just to help me out in my shock so I'm getting a little bit low on stuff so yeah that's a 20 inch it's beautiful it's cream tipped with ad um, avocado no not avocado 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 where'd that come from it's a 70s Christmas drink isn't it <laughs> oh is it yeah I don't know but yeah this one it is avocado isn't it yeah, avocado. I thought it was. I don't know what made me say avocado. Honestly. I don't even drink either. Old times. For Christmas or birthday or whatever. But yeah, and that's the avocado. <coughs> the back. This is a... What size is this one? This is an 18 to 19 inch chest. And that one's a 20 chest, that cream one. This one is 22 inch, so it's that. Another beautiful, beautiful cardigan. It's the back, gorgeous. And that comes with a hat. These are gonna go up onto my Etsy. That comes with a hat. Uh, I'll put this one up as well. This one is, wait, what size is this one? 12 to 24 month, this one. My niece had one of these hat. My niece's little girl and her wife, their little girl Hattie, had this one. Beautiful, she loved it. That's that one. And the last one is this one. Now this one is extra special. This one has been made with Aaron. It's James C. Brett Aaron with alpaca, twenty-two to twenty-six size. This one. Oh, it's so beautiful. So so soft. There. That. There. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So I'm going to pop them on this pattern. There is cable down the sleeve. So I'm going to pop those up on Etsy. Um, that's a job in itself, isn't it? That takes forever. But yeah, so that's what I've been up to today. It's nice and sunny here. Nice and sunny and bright. Um, we've had, we've been lucky where, I don't want to jinx it, but we've been lucky where we are. We've not had any snow like other places have. I know Manchester have um, places up Yorkshire and I think down south even have but we're in the middle of the country so we've like dodged it which I'm thankful for because I hate snow as Sheila was saying um, in her video she was saying about um, hating the snow and not she, she don't like driving not hating the snow but she doesn't like driving in it um, neither do I can remember when we had the beast from the east? Oh my goodness. Oh, no, it's just, it, oh. I took the lads out, they were going on a works do, and I took them out, oh, I never again. I stopped, went to press my brake at traffic lights, like from miles behind. I, sk I skidded straight through, it's a good job there were nobody on the road. I just went straight through the traffic lights, it wouldn't stop. 10 minute journey home took me like an hour and a half to get home. It was horrendous, absolutely horrendous hour. Oh, never been so scared. Yet the year my husband died, we'd already booked to go to Centre Parks for Christmas for the kids. So we carried, um, not for Christmas, but for the Christmas period prior to Christmas day. So I, I took the children and we went anyway. He died in the September and I took, took the kids in December. And, um, it that was 2009 when it was horrific horrific snow but i took them i drove in it i didn't bother it didn't bother me i just went an old Daihatsu yrv it was beautiful car it just plowed through everything now the i don't know these new cars you see a bit of snow and they're like me traction control comes on it's like oh steady be careful um but yeah that other car i drove to center parks it took me two and a half hours to which would have been a 40 minute journey, we were about two and a half hours to get to Centre Parks, but you know, 
because we live in the same counties as it. So, <laughs> but I don't know. But yeah, so we've been really lucky. Um, I better shake a leg on her. Oh. And take her on a, on a walk. I've got a horrible toothache and all. So, no, I don't know. Drop into beats. I am, honestly. Right, don't forget to like and subscribe. Take care. And I'll speak to you all very soon. Bye.